Hello and welcome to Season 3, Episode 2 of D&D with High School Students. I am here with this amazing party. Now, if you remember in Episode 1, there was an encounter with some mysterious little red devil people, mm -hmm. right? And the party like came together easier. and defeated yeah. these little red devils. And yet, they couldn't decide what to do after that. They're shook. They're so shook. <laughs> Their wig got s not only flew away, it snatched. It um, now, I should bolt. mention that um, we'll do a quick introduction for those who don't know. So to my left, we have Neely and what Beecher. That camera. That camera. <laughs> so, um, Neely, who are you playing? Um, I'm playing Matra, who is a tiefling paladin. Mm -hmm. And my background is an outlander, and me and Matthew know each other. That's right. And Beecher, who are you playing? I'm playing Olin, the Fallen Aesimar Warlock. Um, and I'll be doing some cool stuff. And he has a background of pimp and hustler. Yeah, Beecher Criminal. is so bad at it. I just keep pushing the hustler. Criminal. <laughs> Eventually, we're going to work it in. He's like, no, my, my lawyer hustler. says pimp. pimp. He'll have like a cool cane with like a, yeah, a cue ball on the top and like a top hat. Where they like can't oh, that's get cool. Sick. Yeah. You said a lot of people just use it to sleep around and not die. Yeah. Can I have like the bottom of my scythe have a eight ball on it? Yes. <laughs> One side's the eight ball, the other side's the blade. Yeah. Depends on how you're feeling that day. Just oh yeah. Oh yeah. You flip like, it around. I, uh... Yeah. Like, you know, business up front, party in the back. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. All right. Over there. We have none other than Tony K. Tony, who are you playing? I am Cademan, the forest gnome, uh, and he has a background of a folk hero. He is a folk hero, if ever. Yeah. That's right. Inspiring I'm a big people deal. and giving yeah. people hope. Kind with of the a power big of his deal. Song. Kind of a big deal. Yeah. And All right. I have blue I skin now, kind of. And, yeah. and yes, I'm kind of temporarily, a big deal. until we get you a custom mini, I'm which like we really will. Cool it's, awesome. it's pretty sick, though, Bill. All right, I'm, I'm Skyla. What are you playing? Who are you? I'm Alexia, and I'm a wood elf druid, and I'm an entertainer. So I'm the coolest, actually. That's right. Yeah. And then Matthew is not here, hey, so Matthew, we, Matthew is him. terrible. We brought we brought Sam in. <laughs> Sam, Hi. Matthew sucks. Sam's never played D and D, and she's name? gonna be playing Yomi, <laughs> Matthew's dragonborn um, sorcerer. Right. Bet. And she's never played, so she's. She'll probably do better. What what if she just threw a natural twenty no. on the first roll? <laughs> she like, would. She would. Matthew just fails eight. repeatedly. What if she yeah. just throws a knife and like one hits? Yeah. No, wait. <laughs> no, he does have one. Because he got yeah. the other one. O'Malley back. would just lose his mind. He'd be like, <laughs> He'd be What? So <laughs> he would be so upset. Why didn't she get to play for me? Why'd you guys let a girl? He's gonna come in here. He's gonna come. He's, you know that. <laughs> yeah. You know he's gonna say that with his like Arizona on his food. He's gonna be like, yeah. What? What did you do that for? Yeah. For those of you who remember season one, Krafa, I'm waiting. For those of you who remember season one, and those of you who might miss Cooper, Matthew is basically a shorter, more athletic version of Cooper. You'll see, you'll see. Mark my words. It's going to be like, a blast. More of a douchebag. Yeah. He's he he might be. He, his bro card is strong. Sorry, Matthew. Okay. His bro card. All right, so you guys somewhere. left off. You just defeated all these red little demon people, right? Okay. Right. Okay. And you you saw like there's and as you can see on the wide shot, the great map that we see here before us, oh. there's all sorts of stuff bustling around in this little part of the town, right? So hey, Michael, how's it going? Hey, Michael. Hey. That's hey, like Michael. it from the room. Hey, hey Mark. Hey. Um, Hi, Mark. So is O'Malley here yet? Nope. We're still rolling. Hey, okay. Albert. So, so you heard that there might be some constables coming. Mm -hmm. Now, yeah. not that you guys did anything wrong, but just to you know, like a big remind the happened. audience, yeah. there's ten little red demon bodies all over the ground and blood and, and like guns. <laughs> yeah. and everybody literally in the neighborhood saw you do from all that. Juno. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, this is Bill. This is an issue. Okay, we got it. Like we can just we'll talk it out. Okay. Like, Tony, so, you can't do anything. Tony, you I'm just persuasive. have a pig. Tony, play guitar. Play I guitar. have plus six in persuasion. <laughs> All right. That so here's the guess. question. Do you hear me? I play said guitar. that the town guard isn't there yet. Now, you've been to this town before. Like, frequently in your travels, yeah. right? Yeah, Scott. I so, have. look at that. You've been here before. Um, <laughs> you, by the way, sir, have been here probably more than anybody. And yeah. you know that just down the street is an amazing inn where 
a lot of people go to lay low, if you know what I'm saying. It's a very dark interior, big roomy space. A lot of people go there. So you see this group of excellent, seemingly talented people it's of, like of a variety of backgrounds. It's like us, and them. And you have yet, they seem to know, some of them seem to know each other, but you don't know any of them. What do you do? Cry. Or, uh, I'm gonna try and rally the troops. Let's say, rally. Hey rally. guys, we um, we just caused a lot of commotion, and people don't like commotion. People like comfort. Um, so let's get comfortable at this inn uh, a little bit away because I know it's pretty sweet. Um, okay, no rolls are necessary, but you see this pale-looking almost gray-skinned humanoid who's like looking at, out at you and he, he speaks Sabiche. these words to you, inviting you to leave the area. Yeah. I'm just it's gonna all start. of your turns. Oh. We're not in, oh, we're not oh, in oh. initiative order. Oh. So act out as you naturally would. I'm just gonna start walking backwards. Moonwalking? The end. You know what, Moonwalking? I can go for a drink. Yeah, I'll go. I'm, I'm down. Yeah. I, I like that. Well, like, we, I have, we have a bottle of southern wine. wine. I got uh, I don't think we would my want pipe <laughs> with my mysterious like, substance me that Matthew, Matthew didn't be, want. Like we'd still so be there's separate, more for you. But okay. we'd both go yeah. to the bar. We'll be there. Yeah, we'll be there. Okay, so like one thing, just because I know it's going to come up. Hey, try to avoid talk over. So like listen to each other because the people on the webs are going to be like, it's like schizophrenic. Now I know. So what do you and Matthew do? Me and Yomi, yeah. right? Yes. Yeah. We're gonna not see them particularly, or not want to meet them, because that's something he would do. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna go. Is it like a hotel bar? Is it a bar? It's a big tavern slash Probably inn. So nice. like the whole okay. first floor. It's like is, connected. Yeah. Okay. We're it's basically go this building. Okay. okay. So there's like a big. Who put this cottage up there? I didn't. Carapa. Wait, but it looks kind of cool. <laughs> no. I liked it. I um, thought it was a part of it. Wait, the so cottage the whole, should be over there. Yeah. I made that. Oh, good job. Put it right in front of you. There you go. Or, yeah, that's fine. Okay, so you guys go to this inn. Okay. All right. Caden is like, yeah. I could use yeah, a drink. Yeah, I, I could use a drink. Hank, you know, he's, he's getting hungry, you mm -hmm. know. Being a pig's pretty hard, so. Yeah. He's got to eat, you know. Um, yeah. How are you doing? I, do you, you want to go? I, I mean, definitely want to go. We got okay. some wine. Yeah. Okay. We're going to bring some wine. We got my pipe. So you, you see, you, you make this suggestion. Yeah. And, Actually, and they're like, people are like, no, yeah, yeah, okay. Like, no. Mind. No. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Well played, Sam. Okay, Good you also have playing. to yell at Tony basically, the when you want to play O'Malley's character, up. You just there have you to be, pretend to be a curmudgeon old man. I have the guitar the whole time. <laughs> yeah. Love that. What, what do you say? He's a lizard old Meta man. moment. <laughs> Meta moment. Why is Tony playing the guitar? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So you guys go into this inn, and there's music playing. Like just you know some some random person's playing music. There's a fire crackalack, and it's not. Remember, <laughs> it's not cold. It? It's not cold because you're on a Mediterranean right. island, right. Ooh, but it's still that. fall, so it's like How? seventy. But there's a fire cracking, and there's th crackin somebody's right. doing like a pig roast. I have a question. I have a question. Indoors. That's how dope this place is. There's a big, right. huge fireplace with right a wrought iron spit, and they're doing a pig roast. And there's a busy bar, right? And the sound of like people. It's it's middle of the day, so it's not jam packed, but it's pretty busy. It's like four. Yeah. Now you do see a big round table across the other side of the room where some people are getting up and like. You see a young um, serving boy go over and like wipe down the table with a bucket of dirty water on a rag because this is basically medieval times. They didn't know better. <laughs> um, you know, so he wipes down like this wood table and a young woman sees all of you and she's like, oh, good day, sirs, come on in. She's like, there's a table right over here, madam, sirs, come on. And she brings you over and you go to this, this big round table that's kind of off in the corner. Plenty of people are inside this place. There are people getting up and talking and making toasts, people drinking ale, eating food. There's servers running around with, with like fresh loaves of bread like and vegetable a lady with plates, kids. cheese. Yeah, there are some families, but they're, you know, where you're kind of seated is off kind of on your own. Yeah. Okay. So you get, a, you get to this table, you guys all kind of sit down. Um, somebody stops you at a certain point. They're like, sorry, no pigs allowed. And he looks at the spit where they're doing a pig roast. He's like, unless of course you're bringing that as a, 
a gift for everybody. A donation. I'm assuming since I saw you riding in here that you uh, don't want to eat it. So if you want, you could flip a copper to the boy outside. He'll put it in the stables to the back of the yard where everybody else's donkeys and ponies and horses are. And everyone's like, very good, very good. Mm -hmm. I don't know how I feel about this young man. And I don't know how, Hank is my best friend. And I don't know how I feel about leaving him That's with rude. a stranger. He's going to take Why money from me. Why would you tell me. him all that? No, I'm, I'm just, I'm having a little moment. You know, so. Is this me meta? This meta is meta. Moments. This is a little, meta no, I'm so not Tony, saying it right to him. Tony, you, you know that, like, most establishments wouldn't let somebody bring, like, their yeah. horse into yeah. a bar. Right? Obviously, I get it. So, I can't even so you, like you know that it's safe right? to bring yeah. your, your pig around back. You pay a stable boy like a copper to just like. All right. Well, I just like, they're chanting bacon, Bill. I'm a little okay, bit it was, yeah. it was, it was nervous. But you, you met a moment. I mean? You, your character would know that this is safe. Fine. Also, All right. Yeah. Here's the copper. Okay. Also, now you go oh, sit down. So Moan Snapchat to me. Uh, Bill, are there any? <laughs> She's do, so. Cute. Do I have any connections here? <laughs> yes. Who? To who? Anyone who owns it? Um. No, you know, you know one of the bar keeps, one of the, the bartenders, just from your travels. Like you've stayed in this inn before, not just gone to the, right. the tavern, but like you've stayed in the upper part of the inn before. So you kind of know one of the bar keep, bar keeps. Okay, do I know him on a first name basis? His name is Teo. Okay, um, would I know him enough to ask a favor of him? Sure. Or, okay. Yeah. Um, okay. I'm just going to go okay. over to the bar, okay. uh, get around, okay. and ask He sees you, guy, he's like, oh, how oh, goes it, wanted? friend, Olin? How's it going, Jackson? Tail. Tail? <laughs> Tail. Yeah. Tail, how's Jackson? it going? Oh, it's busy, as usual. You know, the, the Equinox always draws so many people into the city. Yeah. Plenty it's of things crazy. going on. Oh, yeah. So many crazy uh. things going on. It's something that would make you want to be, like, hiding away from public if you catch my drift. Oh! Um. Let's see if he catches your drift. Um, you're going to make a persuasion roll? Seven. He's like, hiding away from the public. Uh, no. I've been with the public, trying to get tips. <laughs> you know, uh, working about 14 hours, 16 hours a day, but it's worth it. Well, it's just such a jungle out there. I mean, I mean, you just want to sit down, kind of take a rester. So uh, I was wondering if you could hook us up with a round on me. Of course. He puts it all on a wooden tray, takes a silver piece from you, you take it. All right. I'm going to bring it back. Okay. Big group. All right, ales all around. Everybody's got a drink. A serving girl comes by with a, a wood plate of cold cuts and bread and um, a couple different chopped up fruits for you to nom on. Are we in the same nom. class as like pirates? No. No? You are not illegal. Okay. Yet. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I get Yet. Cool. Dun, 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 there's music yeah, playing. So as you guys are kind of here at the table and there's food, now would be a normal time in social interaction to introduce yourselves to each other on account of the fact that some of you know each other, but some of you don't know each other. And, like spies. And some of you don't know any of you. So, so you're sitting at a table with this group of people. Right. What up? I'm Alexia. And? That was good. Right? Yeah. And, uh, what's so your who, name? You're saying you have to beat her? Yeah. yeah. Uh, my name's Olin. I grew oh. up around here. Um, been to these equinoxes time and time again. Great, great fun. Great fun. Um, you always see something crazy like what we did see back there. Yeah, it was crazy. You think so? That isn't a little bit out of the ordinary for you guys? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm being a little bit paranoid. Had a little bit of wine. But wait, meta moment, meta moment, meta moment. What if, what if, meta moment, you're right, you're so they introduce themselves to Beecher <laughs> and then they're like, let's hang out. And then they're like, wait, but we know them and me and Matthew. And then we can all go somewhere else. Wait, you guys were coming with? I thought you weren't. 
We have to meet each other. We're all <laughs> sitting at a table together. You're all there. Yeah. Oh. Oh. It's like, yeah. What? So continue, continu you're right, but continue like where you were. So he oh, brings up this point that he thinks it's out of the ordinary. Yeah, I, th I think it's a little bit odd, right? I mean, Oh yeah, like, crazy, crazy stuff. Should we, I don't... should we be concerned? You know, I, should, we, okay. should we talk about it, you know? Yeah, it was crazy. Um, I don't doubt that we're probably going to get some company regarding the what happened back there. Um, so be ready to potentially have to talk to the cops. Say no you can come to, to my it. house. <laughs> Say that to them. Say, let's go to my house. I don't have a house, by the way. <laughs> That would be so funny. Wait, who stayed with the noble person? With the noble? Who stayed with the we rich people? With farmers. With, yeah. You guys stayed with, remember the, you rescued the, the rich guy and then yeah, he brought yeah, you yeah, back yeah. to the yeah. manor? Okay, so sorry. remember he said that you're welcome anytime if okay. you wanted to go so somewhere. Go That's there. just the thing that I'm throwing out there. I'm not saying there. you okay. have to. Okay. So you guys are yeah, talking about say this. No. And Matt, a couple minutes no, go by and the barkeep that you know, Teo, he comes over by your table and he's like, he's like, how's it going? Food and ale all good? Going yeah. great. Yeah, great. He's good. like, uh, you, you know all these people, Olin? Yeah, we just met. Um, kind of crazy, crazy turn of events. Are they, uh, am I picking anything up What I would up call proficient? Him? Roll insight. Wait, 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 wait. Peter's got the coolest guys. Um, excuse me. Okay. I had those last time. You feel like he's trying to scope out this group. You're not sure why, though, because your insight roll wasn't uh, Yeah, I've seen him do some cool stuff. They, uh, good in combat. Why? Well, uh, let's just say it's been very busy around town, and I've heard a couple rumors about people looking for help with I'm certain so things. Shook. Yeah. So, maybe, um... Maybe if you thought this group would be up to the challenge, uh, I could connect you with a couple of those potential companies, if you would. Now, I'd want a little cut myself, you know, a, a finder's fee, let's say. Uh, I get what you're saying, I get what you're saying. Um, yeah, put me in touch with those people, I'd love to talk. Tell you what, I know for sure that uh, one of the gentlemen said he was going to come back here around supper time. So uh, maybe swing back around in uh, four hours or so, and yeah, if he's here, I'll connect you to him. Sure thing. Sounds good. He gets up, he walks off, goes back to the bar, he's working. So you guys are all there. Yeah. So you're pretty popular around here. What if we meet mm. his bartender friend yeah and then he introduces us to Beecher who already knows them and so we're like all kind of sitting together that happens okay okay all right so now <laughs> okay just saying you guys are all there you're sitting there you finished your food and drink and you see a couple constables come in so there's you could tell because they're they're wearing first of all they're wearing the colors of the capital so they're town guards, they're not soldiers, they're just town guards, like basically mm -hmm. constables. So two of them come in, and you see them kind of look around the bar, and they start walking through the bar. Right. Anybody do anything? Mm. I'm going to get up and go to the bathroom. <laughs> I have to go <laughs> to the bathroom. Such a good okay. Move. Oh, man. Uh, I'm going to sit here and talk to everyone. I mean, you know what? You go to the bathroom. Buddy, can you're you walking to the, to the bathroom, and you you guys, and I wanna, everybody roll I perception. So there's a d20. You're going to roll that and add your number this for perception. Find perception on there. Five. Uh -huh. This one? Five. Yep. Roll that. Come on, be good. Four. Plus one. Thirteen. Are you Blinded kidding? So Fifteen. Plus Sixteen. Seven. Plus I got one. sixteen. So fourteen. I got plus two. Four. What if? Seven. What if you rolled? What am I rolling? D20. Oh, my oh. God. <laughs> Shut up, Skyla. Okay. <laughs> there you go. That's so I bad. Got seven. So 16, I got 16, 14. What'd you roll? A uh, four. Okay. I'm so you guys die. are like <clears throat> drinking and having a stare down. And then he gets up to go to the bathroom. The girls. And you and, and you both look over <laughs> and you notice 
you notice that their constables yeah. stop and turn and start following him. Look, guys, I don't know who he is, but he clearly knows something here that we don't. He's very popular. Everyone knows him. He invites us here, right? And the, 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 the constables, they're following him. Yeah. Now, look, I don't want to be the guy who points fingers. I don't want to be the gnome that points fingers. Oh, I don't. Slow. Really, I don't. <laughs> but, like, there's something he's not telling us. And they're on him. Out. We can go. Hate to sell you out, but, like... They're the only ones who knew who he was before everything happened. Yeah. He seems very suspicious. I want to roll an insight. You guys or, have, or they you guys have friends, don't you? The nobles, or right? Or they want to meet him. I really want to meet the... The, oh, your noble why do I keep rolling a four? Now I have a seven. <laughs> Remember what I said about charging your dice? Yeah, I See? didn't charge them. Hold up. That's a two. <laughs> you have oh, to charge it. Oh, my God. How you do have I to charge put it? the 20 up. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I know. That was a great you have to thing let it oh, I can't say that. Okay. 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 So you're Anyone walking towards the, across the room towards the bathroom. Yeah. And then you're like 10 feet away from the door of the bathroom, and you feel a hand grab your shoulder and spin you around. And it's one of the constables, and the other one's right like five feet behind him. And he's like, hold there. We need to have a word with you. About what? Something that happened uh, just a few minutes ago outside of here, just down the block. And he's like, oh, shit. You yeah. matched the description of uh, somebody that we were told was involved in an incident. Uh, apparently yeah, an some incident kind of crazy I... monsters came out. Like and yeah. Me and... Uh... Some other people, I'm not really sure where they went. They must have split, but we... I thought we were still here. You are. We're we just not like split yet. Um, we, right in the heat of battle, everyone just jumped in and helped defend against these weird demons. Do you know anything about them? Where they came from? What they were? No, I didn't even see where they, when they, where or when they came to be. The other guy comes up behind him and he goes, listen, you're not in trouble. We just need more information. This is a very strange thing. Yeah. Could you bring I'll the walk people outside with them. that oh. you were with? I, I'm not sure exactly. Um, Make a deception roll. I'm down to go. Is that, if that's what they're doing. Uh, ooh, 23. You. Ooh, you're like, dang. I'm not sure exactly where they are. They're like, oh, they must have left. So here's what you guys see. You guys see across the room. He was headed to the bathroom. Two constables go up to him. One of them spins him around, stops him. You see him talking, and now you see them leaving out the front door. But we don't know what Can happened. Can I roll in that another insight? Yes, you don't know what happened in that conversation. <laughs> he might have sent so him. You can roll yeah. insight. Okay, come on. I hope I charged it enough. <sighs> insight and perception, or just insight? Um, not perception. Was it fishy looking, or no? That's four why I'm having again. her roll insight. Do you, here, do you want me this to roll? I'll roll insight, Bill. You have to I've charge had, I've had a good I did, stack them. I did four stack them. them. Bill, this isn't okay. Eleven. You don't, all right, you see that this guy, Olin. I have twelve. Yeah, the guy, Olin, doesn't seem to be worried. He doesn't seem to be worried. He seems to be calm as he's walking out the front door with these guys. Okay. But that could be suspicious. Look, it could be. Because she's like really serious. Look. That could be suspicious. <laughs> suspicious. Let's. The little forest gnome leans forward. All right. Lean forward. Well, guys, no, I don't know. What kind of voice does gnome have? Look I was going to try to do like a voice from like Shark well, or you're something. Well, you're small, so no, like, like you're guys. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Look, guys. So, so we're like, all right. So. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know Keep what. it together, Bill. <laughs> All right, I am. I don't, I don't, I don't know anything about him, but I don't know anything about you guys either. He helped us out. He clearly doesn't like these little red things either, mm. which is still the first thing on my mind. Okay. Because it seems like everyone else has kind of forgotten about the little red babies, but I'm still upset, guys, so and I'm not going to forget about it. They're not babies. They're devils. I know. That's what I'm saying. But they were like... Babies. So, so you guys see him leave. Now, Let's go. they're out the door. What do you do? You just stay at the table? What do you do? No, we leave. Mm. No, we talk about it. Right, so you're so talking about it. But before I go back to Beecher, leave. I need to know what you guys are going to do. I think we should... Never mind. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sit down and wait for him to come back to us and see what he does. He's leaving, I thought. No, he should like, come left. back and sit down. The constables walked out the door, the constables walked out the door with him. 
Oh, with him. With him. Okay. Like one's got a hand on his shoulder and the other one's behind. We follow him. them. We wait, have to spy wait, on wait, them. Wait, wait. How long was the conversation? No. It was like wait. thirty seconds. And no, then they we left. should stay. We should okay. stay. <laughs> and Beecher should go wait. and then come back after he's done to wait. like get a drink later. Guys, later. So I'm that's what you're saying. Oh, what do you do? I was I'm, gonna say we spy on them to see what's gonna happen because. We don't know like what they're going to say to Skyler. him or what he's going to say Skyler, to them. Why don't okay. you turn into Hank? That's what I was going to say. Hank, I was going to say I was going to turn like into go. an animal and we were going to go follow. see. Yeah. I'll and turn into a animal. Something to spy for it out. I'll be an animal. Right here at the lock table in the, the crowded in. No, lock no, yourself I'll go in to the bathroom stall. No, I'll go outside for a smoke. Yes. And turn into an animal. Yes. Why do you? Go. I'm going to go with Hank, but like one of you guys got to walk with like watch her. So you guys are going to, you walk oh, to the other side of the room, so guys, you go out the back door. I go out right here, okay. out this little mm -hmm. <laughs> window, come out here, turn into... Before hmm. you turn in, make a perception roll, make a perception roll. Come Anybody on, else going outside or are you two sitting at the table still? We're sitting we ne at the table next to the window. 13. Okay. Oh, yeah. didn't do four, 15. I got 13, Wait. so I have 14. So, I have so here's 20. what you see. You see from, from across there, you see, uh, Beecher, where's your... I got 20. So you see him, and you see the two constables. Yeah. And there's a crowd of people. Okay. Right. So, like, they're standing here, and, like, now. I'm over here. Okay. Yeah. Just can I take this off so I can see? Yeah. The problem with nice terrain is that sometimes it's hard to see through. Like, I'm sure somebody's got a shot of my. I'll take off the Back Turning into right ammo now. right here. Um, Remember when people fell through the floor? Yeah. That was so well, like, well, Okay, so there's a crowd of people. You guys do not see them, like, moving around. You see, you see, like, you could see, obviously, that they're having some kind of conversation. One of the constables, like, points to the, the ground, and you see Beecher just go, like, like, I don't know. You shook. Wicked for me. So what do you do? Do you stay over there? Or do you walk closer? There's a crowd walk of people. Walk closer, because okay. I'm an animal. They, okay, yeah. Can I be you, like a this is, You saw this before you even turned oh. into an animal. I'm saying you don't have to waste your My wild shape to thingy? see this. Oh, okay, so we walk closer then. Okay. I think. They already, th here's the other thing. They're already all going to know who we are, because we're like the so, band. We're the big deal. So. Oh, they're big. Rubber playing. band, cut back. You. You go outside with the constables. You see this crowd of people in yeah. the area yeah, where this combat playing. took place, remember? Don't yeah. ruin my idea. You go back there, no, I'm sorry. It's I'm and genius. the constables are like, so, what were these things and what happened? And they point to the ground. Remember where all the bodies were? Yeah. There's nothing. <laughs> there's Shook. nothing. There are no Limbs. bodies. There's no, <laughs> there's no limbs that were cut off. There's no Literally bodies. Bald. The only thing are stains of blood. That's gross. Like, no, was it, I will emphasize one more time. Clean? When you left, there were ten little body. demon oh, yeah, bodies, yeah, yeah. and what now there's do? just so blood spots just on the ground. <gasps> and so the constable's like, so all these people said that they saw you and those other people fighting against some like, creatures. Yeah, so but like when we got here, we didn't see anything. We just see the blood. So where are the bodies? What were these things? Can you tell I'm us about I'm not sure. Them? We were here watching a live performance, um, and... Mm, nice. All of a sudden, just out of the blue, a guy burst. Um, or I don't know that information, so I don't know. Um, uh, well, but it, it, it's safe to say that it was all of a sudden because yeah, you, you didn't sudden, see like ten. Sudden, it's not like ten demons walked up or flew in. It just happened. All so. of a sudden, these weird demon monkey things Basically, started attacking us, and I snapped into action. Um, as well as the other people in the party. Make a perception roll. One. <laughs> Blind Red. Red. You're telling Worse your story. Four. You guys are there. Yeah. So you're hearing him now. You, you're hearing him explain yeah. what happened, and he's basically just telling the truth of what happened. He doesn't seem to be in trouble. The constables haven't put, like, manacles on him or anything. And the crowd of people around are like, yeah, that's what that's what it was. They, were, the they just came out of nowhere head. and blah, no. murmur, murmur. Like, and people are, like, whispering, yeah. and they're like, yeah, what were those things? So you guys are there. So this is happening now, okay. real time. Um, real time. And as we fought them, uh, we... Actually, the other people in the group somehow used a spell to put them to sleep. Um, 
and then after that I just quickly Dipped. Uh, decapitated all of them and left their bodies here. And now that we're back here and they're not th that here, the bodies aren't here obviously, oh. Oh, I am so just as confused as you are. And I'd love to get down to the bottom of this. We can back his story. He's like, who are you? We're you see the, the constable look over them. to the forest gnome oh, and my like, gosh! Like, we're the, we're I was the that incredibly these good These are the amazing people that helped me fight these monsters. And I was And I'm going to beat like, I'm going to go meet the I band later. And you then can, he gets to you them you and can he's like, on Dungeon Cloud. So one of the two constables goes, he's like, wait a minute. Is that Cademan? Stop it. Stop. He, I, he knows you by reputation not because you're a folk That's hero. sexist. He's that's like, sexist. Are, are you Cademan? <laughs> yeah, that's what they He's call like, that, that's me. That's He's my not. name. Don't wear it out, man. Come Who's on. That? I just pose like And other people are God. like, yes, murmur. Uh, it's Cademan. Sure. Can I sign wait, something for you? Both. What? Where do you know He's me like, from? He's like, wait, you, you, you and you were also in this? Like, you saw yeah. these little rats? Yeah, oh, I so could... So do you know what they were? What, how did no, this happen? No, we have no idea. We were just lucky enough to meet All these right. very strong people who were able As to As you were us. explaining this, we're you guys right. are sitting in the table, and, and you see, like, man, two or three people... So much. I know. You see two or three people get up well, from I their tables, this. and they're walking over to the windows to look out this way to see what's going on. Aren't we already sitting by a window? No, but you can get up and look out. What if we're at a table? Matt, can Matt we move to like, like isn't you know how there's a bar there? around the window sometimes? Yes. Isn't can we move up there? there? Couldn't we yeah. go and like, yes. watch the pig So you go up to the upper level. Yeah. Sam's good at this. And you're looking yeah. out the balcony yeah. and you see this whole thing <laughs> unfold before you. <laughs> okay. And you see, <laughs> you see two constables who are now talking to not just Olin, but to the elf and, and we're like, oh snap, and what's happening? And but it doesn't, pig, but you guys both pig. notice that no one seems to be in trouble. Okay. They're just like people talking and you see yeah. people pointing and now is when you notice because you've got this high up bird's eye view, okay. there are no bodies. And where you guys too. had killed, yeah, where, yeah there, like, where you had slain these little demon uh, baby creature things, mm -hmm. they, they had bodies and you know, there's nothing there except blood stains. Okay. On the cobblestone mm -hmm. streets. Okay. So you're seeing this. You're down there. The constables have lots of questions, and the the main constable is like, "Look, is it like you, none of you are in trouble, in but trouble? we we need your help. This is not normal. It's not normal to have weird monsters just spontaneously happen, and then not even for there to be bodies. This is not normal." Would you be willing to at least just come talk to our captain to kind of explain? You're not going to be in trouble, but would you at least be willing to come talk to the captain and explain what you saw? And maybe we can ask one of the sages uh, at, at the local temple if they know anything about what these creatures could possibly be. Sounds like a plan. Don't I? I'm down. Am I from the noble temple? No. What am you, I from? So yeah, you know, you know but people. But I'm not like with them, with them. No, but you're respected enough to be able, like, if you wanted to, you can go to like any of the temples of Vusek and like, like nearby. Use, yeah, you could pray there. You could, you know, meditate there. You okay. could use their library. Okay. They would recognize you. You could. As a, as a some Okay. It, like, from our point of view, does it look like they're getting in trouble because they're leaving them? Leaving with them? No. In fact. Okay. There you see them now talking, and, They're like and people are like nodding and stuff. Okay. And um, so, We're like at any point, do you guys mention the other two people who were involved? No. no. Yeah. <laughs> maybe they're like, yeah, maybe they went to this thing. Yeah, we can we can just be like we be like. Yeah, there, there are a few other people. No. I, I don't see anything so, wrong with it. So there's a little kid watching. He's standing on a crate just okay. to see. He like points up at the balcony to the building, he's like, there's the other two, they're right up there. The lady with the horns and, like, the, and the tail and, and the old dragon guy. And he points man. up and, okay. and so you guys does, look. Does, does, Matt, like, does Matt like, smite him? Yeah. Yeah. I think Matt would spite, smite show, the actually. kid. Everybody in the crowd turns around and looks up there and other people are like, Murmur, yeah, that's it. The, the dragonborn there and the, the tiefling, the knight, she was involved in it and killed people with her giant mall axe. But isn't this a time where like everybody's here since it's the equinox happening? Yes. Yes. It's so not like I... it's not like you're the only white person in Africa. But <laughs> yeah. at the same time, at the same time, all these commoners just saw you guys like 
open up a can of whoop <laughs> ass on ten little demons. <laughs> Sorry, that was so, so like funny. they remember they remember what you look like. You're like damn, that was cool. Because they saw it. Yeah, if you had just walked by them in a crowd, they wouldn't remember who you were. Yeah, probably. But because you guys like kind of just like you know. Yeah. So the little kid points up. The constables are like, "Excuse us, could could you come down? You're you're not in trouble. We need your help. Please come down." You guys come down. And we. Mm. Like we kind of, we kind of like look at each other, like, mm, should we? And then, were we getting ready to leave anyways? Yeah. Okay. I feel like let's try not to see them on the way out. But what if we accidentally do see them on the way out? And as a like, paladin, uh, as a person who respects lawfulness, okay, you would feel meta moment. You would Obligated. feel compelled meta moment okay. to help out these constables. They are oh. the law. Okay. Okay. They've asked for your help. Okay. As a paladin, role playing hashtag, role playing. hashtag. you would be all right on meta moment. So you guys walk out, and several people turn and clap, and they're like, "Yes, there they were." And, and like one of the the old farmer men is like, "She she put up a Feature. good fight. She slayed several of them just by herself." And like they point to her. So you guys walk up, right? And the constables yeah. explain to you, and now you see like even closer. There's no bodies. There's just these puddles and stains of blood. From you know, Sam scared. Twenty minutes ago, when <laughs> when there was the battle, but there's is it no all, bodies. Is it all footprints? Did it get like messily cleaned up? It no, it does not. That's a good question. Now, if anybody wants to roll investigation, you may do so now. No, it is a skill. Yeah. Go ahead. Yellow. Yeah, Which one is that? Right now, or are you going to wait till we're all oh. together? I got twenty. Not? Really? We're not all yeah, together. 20? Well, I got nineteen, okay, but I got plus good. one. I got, uh, I, got one. One. I got eight. Another critical fail. Twenty. Okay, you're looking. Yeah. And you you see an odd thing. First of all, none of the puddles of blood have been stepped in. Oh, so people have been walking around them. Pe it looks to you like people have been walking around what? these puddles, but you also don't see. You know, like if somebody steps in something like blue paint and then they take you another yeah. step, you you'd see it. Yeah. You see There's no, no footprints. footprints with the evidence of blood. Now, you find it mildly hard to believe with this idea. much blood and in, like a, in like a 20 by like, 20 chunk of the street. Yeah. There's nobody stepping. That somebody could have picked up a body and cleaned it up without Whoa. stepping in a puddle here's, of blood. Yeah. Here's something Before else. The blood. That little boy has been watching the whole thing, clearly, because he was out there for the fight, he's out there now. Someone must have seen something at some point. There, there's no way the bodies were there one second and then just not. You're because, saying this as Kateman? Yeah. No. No, 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 I'm meta saying this in the meta moment still, sorry. Okay. On meta. Just kind of like. All right, good, good share for the line. group. What do you actually say? Okay, so to the cops, can we find someone who maybe saw there had to have been one of the crowd members who saw the Maybe fight and then saw the bodies afterwards. There's got to be a better witness here. You see... How about that boy over there who's been standing on the cardboard box? <laughs> he seems to have a pretty good vantage cardboard? point, and he's been watching almost the, everything. Doesn't he have you, to roll? You see the... Yeah. All right, so first of all, you can roll persuasion, but I don't... This would never happen. No, but here's the thing. If you, like, actually role play something that's reasonable, 18, I don't always make you roll. 18, 18 it's plus... Good. So you killed it. But the point is, is that six, if you actually six, role-play it out and it makes sense in a common-sense sort of way, no it's reasonable, opinion. I'll just let it happen. I make you roll when it's a challenge, when it's something that your character maybe didn't normally do or that you didn't actually think of, but I want you to roll if you ask or if, you, gotcha. if it's possible that your character would notice something. So you say this, right? And the, the constables are like, yes, good point, uh, fair gnome, but... At the same time, we did ask all these people, uh, boy, you over there, did you see anything? And, do they slip and he's like, I, I don't remember. It was like one minute they, they all the things were dead, and, and then they left. And the next moment, we looked back, and there were no bodies. And like another old lady's like, yes, I, it was the strangest thing. It was like I turned away for just a moment to count the how much um, rice. rice I had left. Yeah. <laughs> and so like... One yes. by one, all these people around here are all like, it's, it was the Great strangest migraine. thing. <laughs> are you suspicious? I'm very suspicious. Anybody so, who's suspicious, now roll insight. That what happened? Roll insight. Nat 20. Nat 20. No! Good. 13. 
Six, I got nine uh, total. I got. I have to reroll. I just got so dizzy. I got. Oh, Matthew's that sucks. typing. Sixteen plus one. I got uh, seventeen. Seventeen. Uh, I got nineteen. Nineteen. Thirteen. Twenty. Twenty. I get a ten. Okay. Wait. What? So did basically, do? all 19? of you. Okay. All of you. Yeah. Who are suspicious, which is all of you. You're looking around at these people as they're explaining each one of their stories to the constables. They all sound and and you're like, they're not Magic. lying. They're not lying. Look, look, you particularly look. This is what with your net twenty are like, they're Every not lying. Response. They're telling the truth. They really don't know what happened. Be true. Yeah. So which makes it even shh, this is how distractions. She responds. Sorry, I'm shook, Bill. Put I'm your hand shook. out. Put your hand out like this. <laughs> capital punishment. <laughs> <laughs> I'm mean, trying to get her to go out. Capital with me. would be death. Corporal. All right. <laughs> so, um, so you guys, you guys happened? all collectively, but especially you and you, who had the higher roles, and you, like you, <laughs> you genuinely do not think that any of these commoners are lying. I don't that think each one of them either. saying. That it was like, oh, I turned away and then I looked back and they were gone. Yeah. Like, they're all telling the truth. That this sounds is like magic. How they perspirienced it. It sounds like magic. Sounds Interesting. Like magic. Mm -hmm. The constable says, so, folk, <laughs> heroes, if you would, would you please join us uh, back at our barracks to speak with the captain and possibly a sage so we can get to the bottom of this? I had a question. Yeah. <laughs> back at the pig roast. Are the people like just staying up there and like turning the pig? Mm -hmm. So, like, have they been up there the whole time? Yeah. So, okay. could we ask them anything? Yes. You run up there. You oh, ask them. Stressed. They say that, yeah, hey, I recognize you. I, I saw you in that battle. You're the one who didn't do very much until you threw the dagger at the very end and killed the last one. I, I, yeah, it's the strangest thing. It's like we saw that battle, and then we went back to turn the pig, and we looked back, and there was no bodies. Okay. Like, And you're like, do I? Same vibe as you got from those people. As, okay. but do I know, like, any, like, Spells, or is there? Roll Arcana. Yeah. 18. You're beginning to wonder if this was not, in fact, real. Maybe. It what? was just an illusion. Shut and we'll find out next episode up! on D&D with Ice. <laughs>